Hello everybody, my name is Tristan Kleinfelzer. Right now I am currently a multimedia journalist for WTAJ. Most of you might know WTAJ, but I used to actually work for PA Football News. Um, I worked there for four years. It was four of the best years. Um, you get to meet a lot of people, not only through the staff, but also during sporting events. And that's one of the big things is, you know, I really got to network while I was at PA Football News. There are tons of reporters, coaches, players, you know, some of the best athletes in the country and some of the best coaches in PA that, you know, I am familiar with. And, you know, I talk to occasionally, not too much, but, uh, you know, it was a lot of fun. You know, you get to see a lot of fun things. And, you know, as you work there, you get to attend more events and you get to have more fun. And, you know, you really build credibility because there's still some coaches that reach out to me and saying, hey, you know, can you do this for me? Well, I'm not there anymore, but I'll gladly transfer over to to PA Football News, but um, it's a lot of fun. Um, the staff at PA Football News is amazing. You know, there's really no hate. There's no, you know, what word am I looking for? Maybe there's no stress. You know, part of my job today is a lot of stress. You know, you don't get that at PA Football News. You know, you get to do a lot of fun things. You get to do player previews. You get to go to all the sporting events for free. You get to talk to some of the best athletes in the country. You know, I, I got to the chance to, to talk to Julian Fleming, uh, Stone Saunders now. Um, so, so many high caliber athletes that I got to meet and, uh, and cover. Um, I wrote 300 plus articles at my time at Pay Football News. I was there for four years. But if you guys start now, you guys will be able to do a lot more than that. You know, it takes a lot of hard work. You know, if you want to be really good at what you do, you have to have practice. And that's what I got to do at PA Football News because the number one thing is you have to know how to write before you do anything. That is the biggest thing, especially in this ind industry. You can talk in front of the camera all you want, blah, 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 blah. But if you can't write, you're going to struggle because you really want to be able to grab the reader's attention and pull them in. And you will have a split decision time to do that. So it's really important that you guys know how to write. But, uh, definitely definitely some of the the best times at pa football news i got to travel all across the state i got to do a lot of things that you know your average college student wouldn't be able to do you know a lot of people are out partying doing all that stuff you know don't don't do that really really if you want to be in this industry you have to work hard and you have to start early just i i was on tv maybe five times before i started at wtaj but because of my skills, because of my writing, because of PA Football News, I was able to secure the job because they saw in me an, an ability to be able to be able to work. So, you know, um, I'm very grateful for that. And uh, if anybody has any questions, you know, don't hesitate to reach out to me. You guys are talking to Billy today. You know, he's, he's a great person as well. He'll, he'll be the main man to go to. But uh, thanks, guys.